Hi guys, as I'm sure you can see by the title of this video, today I am finally, finally, finally going to be filming my dungarees styling video today. It's a very highly requested video, I even asked you guys on an Instagram post as to whether I should do it, and then I got really, really busy with uni work and filming other things for YouTube, but today I am finally going to be filming it, I'm super excited. But today I'm going to be showing you guys four outfits of styling my dungarees. The first one is going to be a beige themed outfit which incorporates this t-shirt that I'm wearing right now. The second outfit is going to be like a casual school outfit, something I would wear to go to university, just like very comfortable. Third outfit is going to be a date day slash date night outfit. Um, there's just a very quick transition from day to night in this outfit as you guys will see. And then lastly, the fourth outfit is going to be a cute outfit. You guys have already seen this cutie outfit before as I've posted it on my Instagram and you guys seem to love it. So yeah, let's get into it. I'm really nervous. I've never filmed a styling video before but you guys requested it so much that I just kind of decided I should do it. But literally anything for you guys. So <laughs> here we go. Um, so firstly, I will just quickly introduce these dungarees. So these dungarees, or as the Americans and many other people may say, overalls, I actually got in a vintage store in Nottingham in the UK, which is where I went to university. That was maybe around five. Okay, it's coming up to four years now. They are still in absolutely perfect condition. They were from a vintage store, so they are originally, I would guess, 80s or 90s, probably late 80s. They're really cute. I'll show you guys the details. So they have these really cute buttons that, they're actually a brand called Oshkosh, which is actually a kid's brand, but for some reason they had adult sized um, dungarees. I don't really know why. They have a lot of like green detailing, which is super cute. As you guys know, I love green. So yeah. yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I must have had these maybe around four or five years now. So they are a little bit baggy. Um, you can see that they don't like fit tight, but actually I love that they are super baggy. They are literally the most comfortable things in the whole world. And I love that you can dress them up or dress them down. <laughs> So that's what we're gonna be doing. So this is the first outfit. Um, I've got a cup of tea. It's very hot though. Oh, it's lemon tea. Oh, that is good. Okay, so outfit number one. Let's go. Got this beige t-shirt that you guys have seen. This one. And then my cute little headband thing. Just like this. Oh. This is the most difficult. No, that's too much hair. And then this gorgeous necklace. Yeah. Ooh. And then the bag. This bag. I don't actually own beige sandals, but the kind of like black hair on the label I think looks good with this. And obviously it matches with the headband. So that is outfit number one. Feels weird doing a styling video, I've never done it. If I wanted to add more black, then I would probably just like pop these sunglasses too. And balance the black from the shoes. Ooh, wee, ooh, wee, ooh. I'm feeling super summery in this outfit actually. I might wear this outfit on Saturday actually. <laughs> I really love it. So yeah, that's outfit number one in focus. Uh. <laughs> so this is outfit number two, which I'm refilming because <laughs> it wasn't in focus. That's why I have slightly wavy hair because I just had the plaits in my hair. <laughs> so this is the second outfit. This is what I would usually wear to go to university. It's very comfortable, very casual. And if it's a little bit chilly, then I would just wear like a hoodie. So just like this one. And I usually like to have my hair up if I'm in the lab, I guess, or if it's hot, I usually put my hair up, so just simply like this. And essential for when I'm at school, because I like to not really talk to anybody, maybe. Uh, my AirPods. There's no music playing, but uh. And then, of course, my school bag. 
I don't remember where I got this bag from, but it's so cute. I think I got it from Abley, which is where I buy a lot of my clothes, actually. Basically everything I own. If it's not vintage, it's from Abley, which is a, it's an online Korean shopping mall. So outfit number two is, yep, yeah, just school, university, casual kind of look. We've got the green, the green, the green. <laughs> Wait, how many greens did I say? The green, the green, the green, the green, the green. My ankle just clicked. I love this outfit. I definitely wear it at least once a week. It's super comfortable. Yeah, it's just casual and comfortable. Outfit number two. Ooh, is my hair crazy? I'm not very good at this. Uh, this butterfly clip situation is a mess, yeah. I really hope that that was in focus this time. Please? So the next outfit is date day. Outfit, date day. Look how cute my little pirate sleeves are. <laughs> ah, no. Oh. Oh. might go in with a cheeky headband. So we've got this cute headband, woo, and the pearls. And this shirt, I love this shirt because you can still see my tattoos through it because it's um, sheer. I mean, that also means you can see my bra. Well, um, but this would be like date day outfit. Which one? To be honest, you could probably wear either. This one is cute. And so is this one. And for shoes, we're going, oh, that was my phone. With my docks. Oh my God, I'm not tying these laces. Oh, chalk the laces. With the docks, I think the black bag looks cute. And to be honest, I could probably put a cheeky pair of sunglasses in this front pocket. So this is outfit number three date day outfit. Da, 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 da. I love this outfit too. I might wear this at the weekend. I could probably wear the sandals too with this uh, for the daytime look, but I've got my docks. For the nighttime look, I would probably just throw on this the bag. So it's just very simply changing to this long coat. Um, but it just kind of makes it look a little bit more nighty. <laughs> now for the cute look. You guys have definitely seen this on my Instagram. I posted it really recently. I wore this really cute gold necklace. I'm not really gonna go crazy on accessories today because I'm not really a massive accessories person. I usually just wear the same, the same one. So the cutie look is quite simple, I think, to be honest. I may braid my hair. Shall we do a quick braid situation? My hair is so long now. It's literally so long. I think I may just kind of like let my hair grow out and bring my natural hair in a little bit more. But guys, let me know what you think. Whether you miss me with like the silvery white blonde hair. I know I kind of miss it, but I think I like it being like that in the winter and then being more kind of like goldy, warmer toned in the summer. But let me know what you think. I'm always happy to hear you guys' opinions. Opinions. So yeah. Gotta be cutie with these. For a bag, I will probably just use this. Looks cute. And then the green dunks. Oh my god. Please don't. Probably the green. Green sunglasses? 
do on green sunglasses? I think I do. So it's outfit number four, cutie outfit. I'm just gonna be doing weird dances the whole time. Whoa. If it's not so hot, I'll probably wear this jacket. I think this is this is the outfit that I put on Instagram was with this jacket too. Oh, it looks really cute with the jacket and the bag. So yeah, depending on the weather. Those are the four outfits that I prepared for you guys today. Um, please let me know if you enjoyed and which one was your favorite. If you guys want to see more styling videos, it could be styling something else, not necessarily the dungarees or anything like that. Maybe like where I buy my clothes or something like that. I mean, a lot of the stuff that I wore today was vintage, um, not all of it. So if that's something you guys are interested in, I can definitely do a video like that. Aside from that, I hope you're all doing really well and thank you for being so patient and waiting for me to actually film this video. I'm really sorry it took me so long. I've just been like swamped. <laughs> it's kind of crazy at the moment. It's just so much going on, not just with university, like everything. Um, but yeah, as always, thank you guys so much for your support. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye.